laid back moods, sky above, sand below, good vibrations, feeling mellow. Here, Sly? If we can't see it, we can't do it, right? Yeah. Oh, no. The only we I want to hear out of you is when you're on a loop to loop going, we! <laughs> now, I'm serious. We'd be giving up valuable time. Homework time, band time, dating time. You know, he's got a point. <laughs> okay. So no matter how hard Tiffany tries to get us to volunteer, we refuse. We're strong. We're a team. Trade your butt. Hey guys, I'm signing. Hold Paula. it, Tiffy. You and your sickly sweet community service project can just stay over there. You see that line? No. Don't be difficult. It's there, and we're not crossing it. We're not joining you in the land of do-gooders, right, guys? Yes. That's right. right. Oh, you don't have to. It's not required. But I must admit that I'm kind of disappointed. There goes Jake. You know it. <laughs> and no big deal. So the neighborhood watch helped Lorena the night that her car broke down, but she doesn't know them. Tiff, are you trying to guilt me into crossing that line? Maybe. Is it working? Oh, yeah. <laughs> and Mark, you don't owe anything to the community cleanup projects for giving you a nice park to have picnics. Well, Grandma Winkle does love chasing those squirrels. <laughs> Forget her. Woe is me, alas, a lack of two. I mean, she could say a bunch of orphans had no presents on Christmas but a dried up clump of crunchy brown play doh. <laughs> oh, those poor waves. No. Don't cry, Tony Claus is coming. <laughs> Go ahead, volunteer. Aid the community, you losers. But nothing's gonna get me over that line. You hear me? Nothing. Hi, we're volunteers for the Telephone Help Hotline. Nothing but that. <laughs> As a Telephone Help Hotline co-volunteer, allow me to escort you. Isn't helping others wonderful? It makes my insides all warm and fuzzy. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you guys are volunteering. You'll see. Making a difference in someone's life will make you feel great. <laughs> yeah, you know, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, I just volunteered for the blood drive. I need a pipe from each of you. <laughs> Come on, guys. Okay, now remember, giving advice is a big responsibility, so you must listen, be supportive, and, oh, above all, be honest. Oh, that reminds me, you're gonna need fake phone names. <laughs> it helps the callers to be more open if they don't know you. Hey, I'm a pro at spying the true nature of people. And let's start with Sarah. Sarah, your phone name could be... Sweet Girl. <laughs> and your... Hot Girl. And your... Jake's Girl. <laughs> All right, well, going by the inner self theory, that means that you're... Ferret Boy. <laughs> no. You're looking from the wrong angle. From where I'm sitting, I'm... Romeo. Winkle, you'd better get serious. Okay, and the rest of you, pick some real names. Whoa, great timing, great time. Uh, Sly, uh, why don't you just listen before you take any calls? Look, Sly, I realize that to you, volunteering is just a way to bag babes. But we're gonna get some people with real problems. So you'd better start taking this more seriously. I do take it seriously, really. I'm serious about each and every one of these girls. <laughs>
volunteered at the Friendly Hands Thrift Shop. Amazing, huh? And I, me, Lorena Costa, actually donated something to the shop. <laughs> What'd you do? Give him a sweaty old pair of aerobic shoes? I could have thrown them away. Lorena, I'm sorry. I'm just edgy. Tony and I are doing his meals on wheels thing. He cooks meals, and I deliver them to sick people. Nobody asked me to make a donation. I mean, it's supposed to be a simple meal, right? But not with Tony, no. He has to cook, so now he's chef homeboy Abdi. And they were very expensive aerobic shoes. Right, I'm sorry. Tony, come on! Uno momento. The salsa, uh, she's uh, bubbling. Hey, guys. Guess what? I'm volunteering to clean up the environment. Stink. I thought it was a nice thing to do. No, no, no. She means you stink. Oh, that makes sense. We just finished cleaning up a swamp. I can't wait anymore. Tony! Ah! <laughs> the camel, man, you nearly made me drop my creations. What the? Hamburgers? I waited three hours for hamburgers? What? Get out of my face, you huckleberry. <laughs> they are not hamburgers. These are pheasant under bun burgers. I don't care. <laughs> smells good. You mind if I uh, take a little... <laughs> Dicks, dudes! Vampirella's coming! Anybody want to donate? Blood? <laughs> I know, it's terrible losing a beloved pet. Maybe you should try talking to your little sister. Yeah, make that a large pepperoni. <laughs> but take your time, Vinny. Rushing only creates stress. <clears throat> um, excuse me. Uh, breaking bad news is never easy, but um, because of budget problems on Friday, the uh, hotline will be shut down. Yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry. Oh, no. If the hotline goes, the girls goes. <laughs> uh, excuse me, sir, but the help hotline is too vital a service to lose. I mean, if I can figure a way to come up with the money, can the room still stay open? Yeah, of course, but how? How, how Sly? Sly? How? <laughs> Simple. My band, the California Dreams, will play a charity gig. Oh, a charity gig? Yeah, that's a great idea. idea. Whoa, Sly, cool. you can just volunteer the dreams. And besides, whatever happened to your cardinal rule? Never do anything for free. <laughs> Ordinarily, that's true, Tiff. But right now, I have to answer to a higher source. <laughs> hey, lady, we got this sofa loaded on the truck. What else can we take for you? It's right there, boys. Take it away. You better be careful, Lorena. I mean, I know that giving feels good sometimes, but it is possible to go overboard. Hey, how did everyone like my pheasant on the bun burger? Oh. Ah. <laughs> they love the man. I mean, they love the way you cook that pheasant and how thin you slice those tomatoes and that sauce. I mean, it had just a hint of cilantro, man. It was you just... ate them! I couldn't help it. <laughs> I mean, that delicious aroma just kept wafting into my face. Jake, how could you? They were for sick people. I bought them tacos. <laughs> They love them. <laughs> oh, I love you guys. Such warm, caring, giving people. Brings a tear to my eye. Cut it out, you guys. He is just sucking up so that we'll agree to play a charity gig for the hotline. But it's just a scam, so girls will think he's sensitive. And it's a good scam, too. <laughs> so I get a few dates out of it. Big deal. The gig will raise enough money so the hotline will stay open. You know, he's got a point. I mean, it's a good cause, no matter how slimy or self-serving his motives are. Yeah! Hey! I love you guys. She wants blood! Oh. 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 No, you don't, Tony! You have to do it! No, no. I'm too allergic to pain to die! Oh. Please! If you love me, you'll give blood for me. Okay, Sam. I'll do it. You will? Honest when? Tomorrow, after school. Oh, Tony, I love you. Mm -hmm, me too. Kiss, kiss. Hey, Jay. <laughs> so, what 
do you think? I think I better stuff myself silly so I don't eat Tony's next gourmet meal on wheels. <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. Good idea. But, uh, <laughs> that's not exactly what I meant. What I meant was, what do you think? I think Vinny makes better pizza than Guy Guy. That's not what I meant, and you know it. Now, come on, play fair. What do you think? It's incredible. All right. It's incredible how much food I've eaten. Now, who asked you anyway? I don't. Yeah. Here you go, man. Now, don't eat it this time. No problem. I couldn't eat another bite. What is it anyway? Crispy raspberry duck with honey glazed butternut squash on the side. <laughs> oh, man. I'll check you later. I gotta get out of here because I told Sam I was gonna donate my vital life fluid to get off my back, so now I gotta split before that bloodthirsty vein drain. Mm. Uh huh. Sam! There you are! I've been looking all over for you! Where is that blood mobile? I mean, my veins are bulging and ready to spurt. <laughs> You're gonna stop if it hurts, right? <laughs> I thought that helping my community has its benefits. Right, girls? Definitely. Excuse me, Sly, but you are not the only one that helped out here. Oh, fine. You guys helped, too. <laughs> well, uh, I gave blood, and I didn't even scream. Oh, give me a break. You passed out as soon as you saw the needle. <laughs> well, it was a big needle. It was big and, 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 and sharp, and... Ooh, I'm starting to get a little woozy. <laughs> Maybe I should get blood. I don't have room for all this food. They really seem to like tacos. I'm going to kill you. Oh, man, but I'm going to do it later. Woo. Hi, guys. You still smell. I'll go play over there. Why? <clears throat> I was wrong about you, you know. You've done, you've done a great thing here. Thank you. Yeah, I think nothing of it. Just knowing I've given back to my community is all the thanks I need. Oh. I'm glad you feel that way, Sly, because I lost that uh, special thank you trophy I had made for you. Problem, uh, man. I don't need a trophy. I've always wanted to date a man with a trophy. <laughs> Where is it? Think man, think! You know, I did see a trophy down at the hotline. I'll get it. Yes, come to Papa Sly. <sighs> gotta get the girls. Gotta get the girls. Gotta get the girls. <laughs> wow, it's late. Somebody must be severely hurrying to call at this hour. Oh well, my ladies await. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm coming. I swear, sometimes I think I can be way too nice. <laughs> what do you want? Um, I mean, this is the help hotline. This is Romeo. What do you want? Oh, I am so glad you answered. Look, I really need to talk to someone. I think my dad hates me. Listen, man, I'm sorry. But I've got six hot babes waiting for me. And if you don't hang up, I'm gonna hate you too. So call back in the morning. I won't be here. I took some money from my dad's wallet, and I'm taking the next bus to New York City. New York City? Are you nuts? Listen, man, I don't know what to tell you. Why don't I listen to Mr. Holka? That's it, Mr. Holka. Hey, hang on, I'll go get someone who can help you. Don't hang up. What? Wait, where are you going? Hey! The way I see it, the way that I feel. There's one thing that matters, one thing that's real Someone to call on, someone to care Someone you know that will always be there To the end, to the end That's the way we've always been To the end, to the end We'll be friends until the end Nothing you can do, nothing you can do 
can say You'll never change my mind to drive me away I'm here forever, I'll always care I want you to know I will always be Attention everyone, I have just been told that we've made enough money to keep the HELP hotline going until the end of the year. Come on, there's somebody you have to talk to. You don't have to speak up, Sly! Can't hear ya! Stay too close to the speakers! I said! Ah, forget it. And there's the guy that we owe it all to. Thanks to his... caring, honesty, and selflessness, there will always be someone at the help hotline to help. I gotta go. Hey, you there? Hello? Hello? Yeah, I'm here. I would have hung up, but I didn't want to be rude. Sorry about that. I'm here now. What's up? Well, it's my dad. He works a lot. So he's never home. Mm-hmm. And when he is, he either ignores me or he gets mad at me for something. Mm-hmm. Well, today's my birthday. All I wanted was some cake and maybe a hug. But he didn't even remember it was my birthday, so who cares, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, come on. Can't you say anything but mm-hmm? Uh-huh. <laughs> Thanks a lot. You know, insert name here, sometimes life isn't fair. Are you reading? Huh? Uh, no, no, of course not. Hey, if I wanted to be treated like a jerk, I'd talk to my dad. Later. No, look. I don't know what to tell you. I never listened to my advisor when he told us how to help. I only volunteered to get girls. Oh. Well, thanks anyway. But I'd like to help. That is, if you don't mind me kind of winging it. That's... It's cool with me, I guess. All right. Look. I think it's lousy that your dad ignores you. But running away is just going to create more problems. And it's certainly not going to get your dad to love you more. All right, so we agreed that running away is not an option, right? Right. That is, unless you got a Ferrari, a hot babe on an even hotter island. <laughs> Thanks. You really helped. That's what I'm here for. One more thing. Happy birthday. Thanks. Well, looky here. <laughs> I always knew that giving could make a person feel good, but I did not know it was powerful enough to melt Sly's heart. Get out of here. I don't know what you're talking about. Come on, admit it. You feel great. Well, okay. Helping other people does make you feel pretty amazing. I'm really glad I did it. You know, I feel the same way. Well, except for the stomach pump part. But... <laughs> Can I come in now? No! no! <laughs>
you gonna volunteer, Sly? If we can't see it, we can't do it, right? We? I don't know. The only we I want to hear out of you is when you're on a loop-de-loop -loop going, we! <laughs> now, I'm serious. We'd be giving up valuable time. Homework time, band time, dating time. You know, he's got a point. <laughs> okay, so no matter how hard Tiffany tries to get us to volunteer, we refuse. We're strong, we're a team. You're trying to guilt me into crossing that line? Maybe. Is it working? Oh, yeah. <laughs> and Mark, you don't owe anything to the community cleanup projects for giving you a nice park to have picnics. Well, Grandma Winkle does love chasing those squirrels. <laughs> Forget her. Woe is me, alas, a lack of you know? I mean, she could say a bunch of orphans had no presents on Christmas but a dried up clump of crunchy brown play though. <laughs> oh, those poor waves. Well, don't cry, Tony Claus is coming. <laughs> Go ahead, volunteer. Aid the community, you losers. But nothing's gonna get me over that line. You hear me? Nothing. Hi, we're volunteers for the Telephone Help Hotline. Surf dudes with attitude Kind of groovy Laid back moods Sky above, sand below Good vibrations Feeling mellow Well, give it up Don't wanna stop Don't wake me With that. <laughs> As a telephone help hotline co-volunteer, allow me to escort you. Isn't helping others wonderful? It makes my insides all warm and fuzzy. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you guys are volunteering. You'll see. Making a difference in someone's life will make you feel great. <laughs> yeah, you know, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> hey, guys, I just volunteered for the blood drive. I need a pipe from each of you. Okay, now remember, giving advice is a big responsibility, so you must listen, be supportive, and, oh, above all, be honest. Oh, that reminds me, you're gonna need fake fo- Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Man, we're gonna trade Joe, bud. Hey, guys. I'm signing- Hold it, Tippy. You and your sickly sweet community service project can just stay over there. You see that line? No. <laughs> Don't be difficult, it's there. And we're not crossing it. We're not joining you in the land of do-gooders, right, guys? Yes, That's right. right. Oh, you don't have to. It's not required. But I must admit that I'm kind of... disappointed. Aww. There goes Jake. You know it. <laughs> and no big deal. So the neighborhood watch helped Lorena the night that her car broke down, but she doesn't know them. Tiff, are you...